paste and paste special. Some of the relevant shortcut keys for paste and paste specials are shortcut key for copying a data is control C, shortcut for paste is control V and different types of paste can be explored by shortcut alt H V. So first we select the data, shift control right arrow key takes me to the extreme right of the cell which contains the data and I press again shift control down arrow key which takes me to the extreme bottom of my data which contains text in the cell and I press control C my data is copied and I do a simple paste function in cell I8 I press control V or we can also click on this option this toolbar I press control V so you can see that my data is pasted with the same text format and the number format dollar sign percentage sign are all there and formulas are also there you can see and in the original data also my there were my formulas you can see that some texts are not appearing because of the space constraint in the column width we can increase the space of the column width by alt o c a this increases the column width up till the size of my text content the maximum text size so that was a simple paste now we will explore the other types of paste toolbar which are these and we will use the same data table which is in our cell number B8 so once again I select the data and I have another shortcut to select the data which is the control A my data is selected I copy the data control C next I come to the cell where I want to paste using the formulas so I click on this down arrow key on the paste and I use this formula paste and I click on this you can see that my table is pasted however the number format is not same as in the original table 1 you can see that there is no percentage sign also and there is depreciation rate and the formulas are same so this is used when we don't need the number formats when we don't need the text format to be the same or the cell formats to be the same let's explore the next paste option which is the formulas and number formatting we again come back to our table 1 and select the data we can also do this with our cursor by clicking on the icon and dragging it to the portion which we want to select the data is selected now I press Ctrl C, the data is copied and I click on cell number H16. I take my cursor and use this function, this toolbar, formulas and numbering, for number formatting. I click on this. You can see the data is pasted. The difference is that the number formatting are same as original, but the cell formats are not same as original. This is used when we want the number formats to be intact as the original data. The formulas are also copied, you can see. Next paste option is the keep source formatting. We go back to our table 1 and I will use this name box for this. I will enter B3 and I click enter and I am close to my table I press control A to select the data control C to copy the data and I come in cell number N16 the down arrow key in the paste and keep source formatting I'll click on this tool you will see that the data is pasted 
and the number format is same the text formats are the same and the cell formats are also the same let's go back to the table which is the B5 I think next time we will use B8 control A we select the data control C copy the data now the next paste option the tool which we will be using is the no borders I click on the down arrow and I click on this tool no borders you will see that the data is pasted however the only difference between the table 1 the original data and the pasted data under the no borders paste is that there is no borders let's go back to the table which was B8 in the name box enter I select the data control A control C to copy the data and I come in cell number H24 this time we'll be using the keep source column width paste option tool which is this paste and I click on this you will see that the data is pasted since we were not having space constraint that's why the data is you know pasted in the same width as in the table 1 the column width are same in this paste option this paste option is used when we want the column width to remain same as in the copied data we go back to the table 1 I enter B8 enter control A control C the data is copied transpose I come to the cell number N24 click on this option and will click on transpose you will see that the data is pasted the difference is that our column heads which were the furniture television are in the row head that's the function of the transpose and the row heads are into the column heads